Breaking news this evening in the trial of Theranos founder Elizabeth Holmes. The jury has reached a verdict. Here's our chief business correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis, now. Tonight, eight men and four women have determined the fate of Theranos founder Elizabeth Holmes. After seven days of deliberations, the jury found Holmes guilty on four of 11 criminal fraud charges for knowingly misleading investors about her company's blood testing technology. On three counts, there was no verdict as the jury remained deadlocked. For seven days, Holmes took the witness stand in her own trial, denying allegations she intentionally deceived anyone about the effectiveness of Theranos' blood testing technology. When asked if investors had lost money because she'd misled them, Holmes replied, of course not. But during a previous sworn deposition, Holmes admitted that a number of her prior claims were not always accurate. I know that we made so many mistakes. David, on those three charges where the jury was deadlocked and couldn't come to a verdict, the judge has declared a mistrial. The government will have the opportunity to decide if it wants to retry those charges at a later date, along with Elizabeth Holmes' sentencing, which is up to decades in prison. David? All right, Rebecca Jarvis on the breaking news tonight. Rebecca, thank you. And Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.